Alrighty guys, cast netting, night time, aiming for prawns and little fish. After I cast net, I'll show you the bucket that we've got so far of a few pilchards and a, one or two prawns. There's been so many prawns that are like this big, they're tiny. Anyways, how to do it. Six foot cast net this one is. Bang, in, in the loop that's already made. we we'll come with that twist, in. I wrap it around one or two times, just to make sure it doesn't come off. Keep doing it. Don't, doesn't really matter how big it is, honestly. And then, make sure there's no sticks. I know there's no sticks in it because I've already gone through it, but make sure there's no sticks, rocks, or anything because that'll just fully mess up your cast. Halfway, bang. Like this, I say in every cast net and video, from head to my waist, round about that. Just around that. It doesn't have to be perfect. From down here, I grab it, bang, bring it up, and over. Up here, bang, make sure it's not folded over too much. Now it's ready. I'll show you guys that again. Okay. Up. Okay, it's twisted. There. Make sure it's not twisted. And there. Okay. I'm going to just cast it right in here. It's going to go over the top. Let it sink to the bottom. It's not too deep, but it's deep enough that there are fish in here. Bring it on up. And up. There you go, I can see something. It's a glass minnow. Yeah, so we'll just spread this apart. There you go, you can see that one flopping. That's a glass minnow. We don't use those for bait. They're not worth it. We'll just make sure there's nothing else in there. No. So these guys are just little things. <laughs> ah! Oh my god, they're squiggly. There. It's like... <sighs> Where'd he go? He flopped away. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's all we got in that class. But I'll come and show you this real quick. Let's see. Corner there, you got a few. And then, yeah, there's a glass meal in there, accidentally. Oops. Probably should. Definitely mum's fault. Kidding. And, um, yeah, that's all. Points.